which I don't view as what I would how call do you an know, How do you know Credit Suisse uh, resigned? I'm just looking it for was in, it. Was in, it was in, it's buried in an entertained press release. You know, when, when you get old like me, Amber, I have to read things three or four times because I'm, I'm not as quick as I used to be. So I read and read and read and read, right? Instead of operating as the innuendos that people would accuse me of, I read a lot. And when I read this, I, it said, and Canaccord is the sole operator here. So then I went to the back press release where it said Credit Suisse. So nuances mean a lot to me. Nuances matter. So anyone should call up these guys and entertain, whether they're in the Bahamas or Bermuda or flying around on the plane or going here, there, everywhere, and say, what the heck happened to Credit Suisse? Why would Credit Suisse walk? And then also last Friday, I think the CMA- well, Could they not have been fired and they just decided to go- Well, any, any, anything can happen, but if, if you're hired to do a job to me, you finish, you finish the job. Unless you're fired. And, well, then why would Credit Suisse be fired? I mean, again, why, don't, why doesn't everyone just come clean as to what either Credit Suisse discovered or was Credit Suisse fired? I'd love to know the answer. I'm sure investors would love to know the answer. But when you look at Entertain, the hodgepodge that this thing is, I don't think the assets that they have and again, they have the rights to Jackpot Joy. They don't own the asset as I understand this thing. I don't think the assets are worth the debt. And it has